Oh, hey, how you doing, everybody? <laughs> yeah. Level 66, and I beat Sephiroth also, did you see how much money I have? 74,000, yeah. That was just from, what, leveling up a few times, that's insane. Now after I'd done the Platinum match, the Hades Cup should be not a single care in the world. <laughs> Enter together, 49th, because we are the 50th seed. And you can start every 10 seeds, which is quite kind, I quite like that. But uh... I beat Sephiroth for level 66. This shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> Good thing is I'll probably level up a few times in here as well. I can't believe I beat Sephiroth for level 66. Jesus. That's insane. And on expert mode. Alright, beating him, in, beating him on normal at level 66 is impressive. Expert mode is just like, wow, well done. I didn't think I'd be able to beat him. I really didn't. And the good thing is, Kurt Caesar should be no problem for me now, because I'm a good, like, nearly 20 levels higher than I was, and I have the ultimate keyblade and stuff, and new abilities and combos and stuff, so I should be fine. I shouldn't have any issue whatsoever. These enemies are just absolutely pathetic in comparison to what I just did. Oh, man. I have never... I would have never thought I'd been able to do that. I dare you to try and do it at a lower level. I dare you to try and beat Sephiroth at a lower level. I'd love to see it. I really would. I'm not saying it's impossible, because I know other people have done it at like level 35, which is... Well, it's either in this game or Kingdom Hearts 2, people have done it and it's just inhuman. But, yeah, like I, I'd love to see someone else try it. It'd be really interesting. But I can't wait to let's play Birth by Sleep because I'm gonna, I'm gonna beat the uh, mysterious figure and I'm going to beat No Heart on proud mode as Terror. I'm going to do it. I'm going to make sure that is something I do because I've got Final Mix. I'm doing No Heart and mysterious figure. And I've got an English patch. Don't worry, it's all done. I've all got it, all prepared. It's on my PSP. It's all ready to go. So probably in April that's gonna start because it's gonna be. I'm gonna do it after the massive amount of games in March um, appears. There's like four games I have to do. Oh wow, this is tough. Um, four. I failed, so what? Meh, I don't care. <laughs> Yeah, the uh, Save the King, Save the Queen, I'm going to do another time. Just because... Well, when I mean another time, I mean off-camera, because... It's just the same thing, it's just this, but... It's speedrunned or alone, like, either one. Like, it's really not worth showing, I don't think. Man, she falls really quickly now. So, uh, yeah, who do you think the, um... The final boss of this place is going to be. I assume if because it's called the Hades Cup and all. Who do you think it's going to be? Because if you if you've played this before, then you'll know. But if you haven't, or you you've never seen it or whatever, yeah, it's not what you're expecting. You're expect really okay. You're expecting like okay. I guess I'll probably be facing Hades. No, it's not Hades. <laughs> Hades is the tenth. <laughs> He's at ten, not one. Hades is, I think, the hardest. Like, number one is easy, if I remember correctly. Like, really easy. Give me a cure. Don't see why not. That's the power of the yeah, it is. 
I beat Sephiroth. <laughs> I actually beat Sephiroth. I'm still shaking a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. I'm... Like, I, I started this with the intention of leveling up. I was at level 65, got to level 66. Then a little bit more, I was just like, oh, I am so bored. I don't know what a good grind spot is. Some people said Hades Cup is a good grind spot. Some people said Travis Town in the hotel, you can keep going through it. Um, the, the enemies don't despawn. So it's just like, you keep going through it, you can get about 2,000 experiences. Just, the problem is, that takes, what, like, two minutes to go through there. Okay, maybe one minute. One to two minutes. And you gain 2,000 experience, granted, but... Experience is so hard to get in this game. Like, in Kingdom Hearts 2, um, in the World of Never Wars, you can get 1,000 experience from pretty much every nobody. In this game, the maximum you'll get is 240. It's really irritating. It's really slow. And the World of Never Wars, at least, like... At least, like, one trip through there. At least, if you go through there once, you'll level up, pretty much. That's how it works. In this game, there's just no way of doing it easily. Oh yeah, it switches up, doesn't it? Yeah, I forgot about that. There's no arena, there's not an arena all the time. Hey, it has the full five bars. Yeah, someone mentioned that, saying, um, uh, did you notice that this one doesn't have the ones in the uh, ends of the world have four bars instead of five. Yes, I did actually notice, I just didn't mention it, but thank you for pointing it out. Um, but yeah, this one has the full five bars, so this is the one from Hollow Bastion, technically, or this is the one they used. This is these copycat. And as a boss, it's pretty easy, let's face it. It's not challenging, may as well cure. Like, I'm destroying things. Imagine if I was level 100, how quickly I'd destroy things. Like, I'm tempted just to show you... I'm tempted to show off the Hades Cup at level 100 on my normal mode playthrough from years ago, because I have everything. Absolutely everything. At the peak that they can be. And it would be interesting just to see how quickly Sephiroth would go down. But, yeah, so... We'll... Yeah. Wouldn't it be funny if I lost the Sephiroth on normal at level 99 or 100 or whatever when I beat it at level 66 on expert? It would be mildly embarrassing, but at the same time really not because I beat him at level 66, so I can't complain. Ever. Like, no one ever doubt my talents. Like, oh, you're str you like you, I've had loads of people think, you play so badly, can you hearts, you just go in and attack, and that's my gameplay style. I beat Sephiroth with it, so fuck off! <laughs> Like, if anyone, if, when Kingdom Hearts 3 starts, I was like, okay, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna explain now. This is the way I play the game. I don't block, I just go in, attack, and kill when I can. If you don't like it, I'm sorry, but I'd beat levels, I'd beat Sephiroth for level 66 on Expert when using this strategy, so I don't care what you say. <laughs> I think that works quite well. As an argument. Oh, alright, yeah, you get quite a lot out of this. I think it's like every boss. Oh, looks quite nice now. Daytime! I want to say the next boss is Cerberus. But I could be wrong. This is really amusing because they're all just dying in one hit. <laughs> it's really not amusing because he just teleports away so I can't hurt him. Could you come back? Thank you! I win! Blue Rhapsody! You're a Rhapsody in blue. I wonder what the trophies are going to be for Kingdom Hearts 1.5 Remix. Because that's going to be quite interesting. And I imagine there'll be, there's got to be a trophy for like one for beating Sephiroth. There's got to be one for beating Xemnas. Because he's a secret boss in Barmex. There's got to be all of those. Got to be. It's got to I'm actually... Um, I've got an ISO of Final Mix. So I'm going to see if I can find a save file. Which is just before Xemnas. Because if there is, I may as well record it. You know, it'd be good. But that is only if I can find a save. If I can't find a save, then I won't do it. 
because it's hard to do. I, I don't I don't particularly feel like going through the entire game again if you get my drift. I feel like I've done enough. <laughs> Is this guy gonna go? Not quickly at all. I'd even say slow. I'm so oh you bastards! I forgot about you, stupid curing powers. Okay, you're so gonna die. Give it, give it ten seconds. When you turn back to normal, and you're going to die. I nearly killed you before, and then you ruined it slowly. Come on, good boy. Son of a bitch! Such an irritation. It's like anal cavities. It just disgusts me. Pots and fly things. If you are the indestructible pot, I will be very unhappy. Although, it, it looked like for a thing you were, because you blocked two of our attacks, which for a pot is quite impressive. Have I, have I ever said how beautiful the Ultima Keyblade is in this game? In Kingdom Hearts 2 it's nice, but I don't know, it's something about this. In this game, it's just the blue on the, on the handle, it's really nice. Really nice. Oh, I'm gonna kill the greens before they just ruin everything. There we go. I have no problem with destroying the stealth sneak anymore. I can now attack the stealth sneak however I please. Didn't even come into form until it died. Even though I just stab at it. Interestingly though, that one's black for some reason, when the other one was green. Oh yeah, I think it's actually a different Heartless. Actually, actually that's why, in fact. I'm pretty sure it is. It's classed as a different Heartless altogether. Uh, if I remember correctly. Um, it actually is a different one. Because, I, I can't remember why, but there's two types. And that this type only appears in the Hades Cut, if I remember correctly. It's probably cure. I mean, I'm not at breaking dangerous levels, but, you know, I may as well. So let me think, who are the bosses? There's... The next one I think is Cerberus, either that or it's 20. I think there's Cloud and Leon together, but that might not be an actual main 10 boss. And there's, then there's Hades, and then there's... Well, I don't know if the seed one is, which I'm not going to mention. The, uh, yeah, there's, there's definitely Cerberus, so there's one type I'm not thinking of. Unless Leon and, and Cloud are now, or level 30, which they could be, actually. It's possible they could be at uh, number 30 instead of 20, because Cerberus might be 20. In fact, I think it is. If it isn't, then I don't know what it's going to be. If it's not Cloud and Leon, I can't think of what it is. It's not... and this opposite I'm about, but that seems a bit silly. It doesn't seem needed. Stupid wizards! Die! God! We're about to find out what it is. Yay! It's better be good. Severus, I think. Yep, okay. I have absolutely no idea what 20 FC is. <laughs> Literally no clue. Ah, oh, yes, four bars now. So this will be interesting, because last time I had trouble against him. In my defense, he is a hard boss. Now I should have no problem, because I'm overpowered. Well, I'm not overpowered, really. But I beat Sephiroth without... You know, at level 66, I think I'll be fine. Do you get hurt by your own darkness? It'd be great if you did. 
Die. I do think Cerberus is a good boss, but seriously, like the start of this game is insanely difficult. Woo! I know, um, uh, Andrew went to here first over Deep Jungle. Which is, uh, was that what I did? I don't remember. I can't remember. No, I think I went to Deep Jungle first. Yeah, so he... I don't know if he had any trouble with this boss, but he beat it without going to Deep Jungle, which means he was a lower level than I was. Probably, unless he grinded quite a bit. Die! Yes! I win! I win! Ah, Thunder Giga Gat. Still have got Winnie the Pooh to do, which I am, I'm looking forward to, but at the same time not. It's weird. I, I don't mind, but, you know, at the same time. I just, I think, I think my problem with it is I'm, I'm thinking it. <laughs> Sorry, really. <laughs> I think Sephiroth wore me out. Uh, yeah, I think, I think I'm remembering it being worse than it actually is. I'm sure when I actually get to it, it's going to be quite fun. The spookies. Look at those spookies. Flying! Is that a cure? Heal. Yay. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Gauntlets! Gargoyle! Fight! Do you know what would be really good in Kira If you could watch the other seeds battle each other? <laughs> It would be really interesting, just to watch it. I know it's probably not going to happen, but Square Enix, if you are watching this, or Square, or whoever's behind it, please, like, have a tournament like this, a really fun tournament again, but, you know, have it so that, it'd be really cool if, oh yeah, they multiply, I remember that, yeah, it'd be really cool if they, um, if they, uh, you could have one where you saw Seed, like, what happens if Seed 49 goes against Seed 1. It'd be really funny, but only after you've beaten it, not so, so you don't spoil the surprise. But it would still be pretty awesome. I'd, I'd, I'd actually be really excited to see that. Because I'd love to see a Shadow go up against, like, Sephiroth or something. Or Hades, or whoever it may be. It'd be really funny. Just like, ah, uh, well, you're screwed, aren't you? One slice. Yes! Well done! Well done, whoever it is. Could be really good for comical effect. Oh my god, it's the Avengers! They uh, are a bit different than the movies. They're also pathetic. <laughs> I think that's the quickest round. I'm trying to think of another one which was quicker apart from round one. But I think that's pretty pretty close. And there's opposite armor. Yes, yeah, it's pretty much like a hey, do you remember those bosses that you really struggle against? Well, now you can kick the shit out of them. <laughs> It's so you can argue it's sort of like a boss rush in that sense. Not all of them here, obviously, but it, it's still pretty good. I think um, I don't think Power like Cages. I'd like to know why this thing isn't dying. Huh! <laughs> 
die. Have I leveled up at all in this? Because I'm not surprised if I haven't leveled up, but I'd like to level up. <laughs> you know, it would be nice. So it'll be interesting, is Sephiroth the hardest boss of the game, or are the others harder? I, in theory, I shouldn't have any trouble with the other bosses, other secret bosses. Um, because I just shouldn't. I beat Sephiroth easily, I shouldn't have a problem with it. But, well I say easily, it wasn't easy, I'm, that's completely a lie. Um, but you know, what I'm, you know what I mean, I beat Sephiroth. In theory, the other bosses shouldn't be as much of a problem. And the good thing is, now that I've been set off at level 66, I now know that I don't ever have to grind again, and that's really amazing. I'm just pretty much, from now on, it's me doing the game, that's it. It's me finishing the game. Like, I, I wasn't in a mood to record because I was just grinding for a bit and I was like, eh. But I thought, you know what, I may as well record. I may as well try Sephiroth. I'll, I'll screw it, I'll try Sephiroth. Nothing and it went well, it went so very well. What scene do we on? I haven't been paying attention at all. Air Corsair. Mmm. Lovely, darling. Thank you for giving me some more experience. I appreciate it. You're actually, interestingly enough, uh, the airships, you get more experience off them if you break um, some of their parts. Like, I know you get um, a tech if by breaking its stern or, or a mast, but you actually get more experience overall, and there's um, a higher probability of um, getting items from them, which is quite good. Yeah, it is Clan Leon, okay. It's just they don't... I don't remember them being that hard, but maybe they are. Maybe they are quite hard. But I'm going to cure because I do not want to lose to you. It would be mildly embarrassing. Okay, who do I want to get rid of first? That's the question. Who's going to be more annoying? I think it could be Cloud. Yeah, Cloud will be annoying when he's overpowered, so actually I'd better get rid of Leon first. Yeah, what I'm doing is a good idea. Because if I battle Cloud, he's going to turn Super Saiyan, and Leon's going to battle the shit out of me while he's in Super Saiyan mode. Whereas Leon just gets a super powered sword, it's not that bad. Cloud literally just goes Super Saiyan and destroys everything while Leon's beating me, so... What I'm doing is a good idea. Plus, he's nearly dead, so I think I've chosen my path. <laughs> if I if I change my mind now, it's a bit stupid since he's pretty much dead. It'd be stupid to keep him alive. Yes, way. Also, he has less health, unless unless Donald and Goofy have been slowly pummeling him quite nicely, which is actually quite likely. Farewell to me! Ho! Hi ho! Hi ho! It's off to where we go. Give me a best shot. Give me a best shot, okay. Because that's what you what you wear, sure. Dude, you're going down. Cloud, you beat me the first time. It's payback. Whoa! I beat you. I beat you. Beat you both. I beat you. I beat you. Oh, Lionheart. I don't care, because I have the Ultimate Keyblade, and nothing beats the Ultimate Keyblade in this game. In King Hearts 2, the Ultimate Keyblade is not the most powerful. The most powerful is the Fenrir, um, which you get for beating uh, Sephiroth. But you get a negative combo, so you lose um, a combo. But even with that, it's actually not the most powerful. It has, um, Fenrir has 7 attack, and Ultimate Weapon has 6. However, the most powerful is actually the Decisive Pumpkin, which you get about midway into the second half of the game. Actually, maybe not. Like, within the last sections of the game. But anyway, yeah, you get... Decisive Pumpkin has the same power as, um, the Ultimate Keyblade, but it has the additional, um, thing called com... is it Combo Boost? Or... I can't remember exactly what it's called. I think it's Combo Boost, I can't remember. It, um, basically... The more combos you do, the more power it does. So, theoretically, like if you have 
if you do say like 20 combos, then by combo 20, its power would peak to like 50. So if you know what I mean, like that kind of principle, it gets more and more powerful as you use it to do a combo. So by the end of by the end of the combo, you're just like, yeah, you're screwed. <laughs> You've just lost three bars in one hit. I feel proud. See this blocking thing? Fuck it. I don't need to use it. I don't need to. Sephiroth can go down. Don't need to use any stupid blocks. Don't need to take down the enigmatic soldier with a block. Are you kidding me? You think the Organization 13 data forms fell down to blocks? No, sir. They fell down to using Final Form and ramming their face in. And also grinding for power-ups and, and defense boosts, you know. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Huh. Dark ball. It's gonna multiply! And then I think it'll do the same with the invisible space one. I could be mistaken. I'm pretty sure it does. I quite like these rounds, they're pretty cool. They're good ideas. I like ideas. Ideas are cool. Yeah, I don't like them when there's thousands of them though. Ow. What I don't understand is just why they're here. Like, how did. How did you, Phil, how did you get, how did you arrange it so that they appeared at a specific time? <laughs> You're very good at that. Are you working with them? Because I would question your motives. A daisy. Now someone told me of a very interesting glitch in the final boss, which I did not know about at all. Um, so I'm going to have to show that off um, when we get to the final boss. It will have I mean I have to restart the boss because I will not be able to get back, I don't think. Um, I could be mistaken though. Uh, but yeah. Certainly an interesting glitch. Invisibles! Yeah, okay, they are here. I thought so. I just noticed they have access for a tail. They also look like they're holding the Fenrir. Are they? They are actually, they are holding the Fenrir Keyblade. The Fenrir looks a lot like that. It's, like, scarily so. Okay, why am I only targeting this guy? I'm, I mean, I know I'm trying to attack him now, but... Oh, I didn't even realise it was at low. Or that low, anyway. That was easy. Donald, not Donald, Goofy rarely appears. Is it, like, he rarely says anything. Same with Sora. It's mainly Donald. It's really weird. Either I'm just cursed with having Donald, or that's a thing that's regularly supposed to happen. Couldn't get the right sound bites or something, I don't know. Couldn't be bothered. Multiple reasons. Two more seeds to go, and then we face off against the mighty Hades. Which will, I actually really like the Hades battle, I think it's great. I think it's a really good battle, if I remember correctly. Now, if I remember correctly, I think to get one of the the uh, special um, Save the King or Save the Queen, I think you have to do it in 30 minutes. Which I'm coming up to, I think, 25 minutes on this. I could be mistaken. I know the video at the moment is like 28 minutes in recording, but in terms of actual Hades Cup, I think it's like 25 minutes. So, I don't know if I'm doing well or not. I can't tell. Unless it doesn't count the waiting around, which you might not. It's just a bit worrying, but I'm going to have trouble trying to beat the Hades Cup in a time. That satisfies me. Or satisfies the game. This 
gonna be a long video, same with the Sephiroth one, they're very long. Hades time, right? Now, I'm pretty sure there's a line he's, that appears in subtitles, but he doesn't actually say. Yo, hey, how you doing everybody? <laughs> yeah, got a minute? Hades, Lord of the Dead, nice to see you. Hey, guess what? I got a place for you down under! There it is, I got a place for you down under. At any point did you hear the words for you? I didn't. <laughs> Because I'm almost positive he didn't say it. Oh, does he? Does he have six bars or seven bars as well? Maybe he does. Maybe he does. Maybe. Oh yeah. This this version of Hades is awesome. By the way, this version of Hades is really powerful. I know. I remember him being tough though, so uh, be careful. He's not easy. So don't expect him to be. Okay, I'm an idiot. Yeah, really. Okay, there we go. The bar starts coming down. Yeah, I think he has seven bars. It's weird that they can not be bothered to make more bars, but I don't really care. I really wish the health bar for bosses and King Ross 2 and like Bell Plus and whatnot was more than just the green one. I really hope they have purple as well, because the purple is really nice. Purple is one of my favourite colours. Has to be a good shade of purple, obviously, but it's done well. It looks really good. And this game is no exception. It does have a really nice purple. Well, so far he's not too bad. I mean, yes, he's hurting me a little bit in, in some areas. Yes, I've said this. You should listen. Clear out your ears. You must have some friends down in your ears. You know? So I like to quote you. What was that? <laughs> was that Hades going? <laughs> it sounded like it. This is probably the hardest round of the tournament because he's actually quite powerful. Um, if you're not prepared, he might. Like, hurt you quite badly, but obviously I beat Seth Rock, so I'm fully prepared for what he's going to lose me. But, uh, yeah, I mean, he shouldn't be an issue. I win, really. Yes, it is, because I just beat you. Yeah, I, I'm trying to think if he is the hardest. I don't think there is any harder ones, but... Whoa! Wow, that wow. Um, wow. Um, wow. Um, um, that, that happened. Hey, what, what are you doing? Stop! Hey guys, get, get away from me! Oh, stop. Come on! Come on! What was that? What just... what hurt him? Oh, there's the answer report. Yeah, what hurt him? Um, was it Cerberus? I'm confused. <laughs> I've never really understood that. But that was some hit you got on him there. That was impressive. But yeah, the uh... I'm pretty sure that's the hardest round, because the... But the first seed, I remember... It's awesome, but it's really easy if I remember correctly. You could be mistaken. I mean, it's likely. But I'm wrong. Because I haven't done it in a while, so... Oh, it's around Donald. Doesn't bother me. Unless Donald ran into me, then it would bother me a little bit. Because I'd get hurt. <laughs> Hey, Sora got to say something. Hey, bringing in all the, uh... Okay, maybe not all of them. I'm surprised they haven't, uh... They didn't have, um... A green there, because... It sort of looked like a bit, a bit like a PlayStation controller. Just a little bit. At first. Oh, don't do that. Oh. Okay, that's nice. Didn't move. Charming. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Sora got two sayings in a row. Well done, Sora. That is rare. <laughs> we got another no stealth sneak. Okay, I'll have to check the general afterwards. I'm pretty sure this stealth sneak is actually a different type. But I could be mistaken. It might even have a different name. I'm unsure. 
I win. Oh, sure. Now you can't die. There we go. Please don't kill me. That, that would suck. Or please let me kill you, should I just say. Because I doubt it's going to kill me. Uh, where's anything else? That isn't the right. Okay. That's a bit weird. Ooh, tough. And since you literally can't get anything from them, I'm just gonna kill you. I win. That was the easiest round. Let's pretty much have a break. Have a Kit Kat. Have a break. Seriously, have a break. Ah, yes. Let's make them multiply. It'll be fun, I promise. I'm nearly done with the Hades Cup, the Hades Cup, the Hades Cup. Oh man, still can't believe I beat Sephiroth at level 66. Oh man, that's just insane. I can't understand how I did that. Hi there, there's a... There's me two of you. Two of you handsome devils. You're able to hide your identity from me. I'd like you to reveal yourself. Make the world a better place. I can't tell if I'm hitting the same one or a different one. I really can't. I just, I'm, I'm sure we'll find out if this one dies and the other one has full health. Okay, they were both reasonably the same at the point of killing that one. Well, that explains a little bit. You will die on top of your fallen comrade. Or maybe not. Oh no, wait. I'm gonna say maybe you will, but they won't. You just don't want to die anymore. Oh, well, don't level up. They will become the the lizard centipede. It's a new horror flick. It will be uh disgusting. Yeah, let's go that. <laughs> The amount of defenders I'm seeing is approximately zero. Ow. Where'd you go? Oh, you suck. Don't be there. No! Damn you! No, no, no doing that. Ah, there's a defender. I don't have much to say right now. I mean, I'm, I'm beating enemies to a pulp. What more, more, more can I say? I've only got like two rounds left. Hey, you have got to say something. Donald's evil that way. Just won't let other people speak. Yeah, I've got two left. Awesome. I knew there was a multiply in the invisible section at some point. Although it's not the same amount that I thought it would be. I, I understand why, because that would be really mean. Because they're evil. I think 50 of them on the screen would be evil. Evil, I tell you! I love how quickly they die, it's wonderful. 
Hey, I upgraded. Is that level 68 now? I don't think I leveled up twice. Though I might have, I don't know. Good, there's six of them. I love six of these guys. Take your bets on what the next seed is. What's stronger than Hades in the Hercules world? That isn't Sephiroth. <laughs> and when I say world, I mean actual the film itself, Disney. What is stronger than Hades? Let's just be honest. And don't say Hercules because we fucking destroyed Hercules. <laughs> and he was pathetic. It's not Hercules. It is weird that it's not Hercules. Sort of because he's that easy. <laughs> Like, I get that he's not a god anymore, or... But he hasn't lost his um, incredible god-like strength. Here we go! The Rock Titan. What's stronger than Hades? A Titan. By the way, prepare to get a lot of experience. This thing gives you 4,000 experience and you get one time every time you attack. Also, if, you tech is, if he attacks you, because the head attacks you eventually, give it a time. If you tech him um, as he, his head attacks, I think you get like a hundred experience from it. Yeah, that. If you tech that, then I think you get about a hundred experience, which is pretty good overall. With that said, this guy is a pushover. I mean, yes, he does a lot of damage to you, but look how much damage I do to him. He's nearly dead already, and this is like only just begun. I took him down once, and he's back down. He, he's hit me once. He's an absolute pushover. He's easy. His only, like, flaw is that he has a bit, like, quite a bit of health. Sort of. Lol, I got back up here. Well, he's dead. I guess I'd say good luck, but then luck won't help you. Oh, yeah, he does one move where he, like, cr he tries to crush you. Am I gonna get to attack his head, or... Oh, I'm gonna attack his feet to kill him. Feet it is! You lose! I win. That was easy. So yeah, that was easy. I don't remember what we get for this. I'm sure we'll find out soon. Oh, apart from the trophy, obviously. <laughs> God, look at that face. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I love this. So happy. Oh, oh. What's Trinity Limit? Is that, an, is that an ability for everyone or... No, it's just for Sora. Yeah, I remember this. It's it's good, but it's not. <laughs> ah, yes please. I want that. I want that. Level am I now? Is it 68? 70? What? I leveled up three times in that and I didn't even notice? Alright. Well done me, I guess. Um, yeah, I have Lucky Strike now. I should probably mention that. And... I guess I should put some of these on, like, Treasure Map, because, you know, I don't get enough money. Uh, <laughs> yeah, there we go, that seems a good idea. Ta-da! Well, I'm going to save. But uh, we're not done with this place yet. Uh, I mean, we took out Sephiroth and stuff, but there's still one more boss that's unlocked. Oh, yeah. 